Has the superhero bug bitten South Korea? A month after Along with the Gods, the two worlds zoomed to box office heaven. Psychokinesis, Yon Sang Ho's second live action film after the astonishing train to Busan, has taken the number one spot in South Korea this week. The story of a man who gains a superpower just in time to save his daughter from a crisis took in $5.8 million in its opening weekend. Pushed back to number two by Psychokinesis is the Lee Byung Hun vehicle, Keys to the Heart, which took in $3.4 million on its third weekend, and that takes its cumulative tally up to $20.7 million. And talking of Along with the Gods, as the blockbuster drops down to the number five position in its eighth week, it took in just under a million this past weekend. That takes this superhero-like movie's cumulative tally up to 104.9 million as I speak. On top of that, within 24 hours, Along with the Gods will overtake Ode to My Father for number of tickets sold and will be the second most popular South Korean film ever. Staggering though that is, Along with the Gods would have to sell an additional 3.5 million tickets to overtake the Admiral Warren Currents to become the most popular Korean film. Frankly, I don't think that's likely. Going further down the list to number 8, Political Thriller 1987 When the Day Comes continues to slide taking just under half a million on its seventh weekend. That takes its cumulative tally up to 53.1 million, but it's likely to continue to hang around the top 10 chart for at least one more week, as 987 When the Day Comes continues to draw a politically very loyal audience. So that's it for now. Click here next week to catch the What Do You Think box office reports.